to the music and action. This is the Indianapolis Auto Show's 100th anniversary, and we're here at the Indianapolis Convention Center. But we're proud that we're one of the oldest shows in the country, and there's only one show older than us. We have been doing this for the last 25 years, uh, the day after Christmas to New Year's Day, here at the Convention Center. And it's a great opportunity for consumers to come in at 70 degrees and sunny, and you can comparison shop look at vehicles, no one's selling anything, so you don't have to worry about a salesman trying to press you into closing the deal. Some of the big attractions for this show, Camp Jeep's very popular, it's an interactive ride where you get in an actual Jeep vehicle, a, tr a professional driver takes you over rough terrain, over steep incline and up a hill, so you get some of that off-road experience while you're right here inside of the auto show. Uh, then the Subaru uh, Legacy has brought us a concept car, which is really neat and it's not in production yet but it's a, it's a cool car. Of course you got the Corvette Stingray which is very popular. I mean I don't know anyone that wouldn't like to have one. Uh, then you've got uh, the Lexus LFA which is a carbon fiber $375,000 car. So those things aren't in production but they're still very cool to see. And then you've got very you know Range Rovers, Cadillac Escalades, Mustangs, Lotus, you have uh, Camaros, you have Challengers, so those retro cars are still very popular. We have the interactive Ford robot, which is a crowd favorite, where he'll uh, impersonate voices, answer questions, talk directly to the crowd. There's also a racing simulator Ford has, so you can see what it's like to race a car, which is very cool. State Farm has two driving pods, so they talk about some safety features there, and then of course they have a photo booth and some giveaway prizes, which is nice. There's a very, very good concession area that we have sectioned off, so you can get, you know, hamburgers, cheeseburgers, fries. I mean, so family can take a break because it takes a long time to get all the way around this thing. It's a great family experience, especially during the holidays because a lot of times people are off work and they're looking for something to do and you might even have relatives in, that, in from out of town. So it's a great place downtown. Everything's well covered. You can park and stay covered the whole time.